Hi everyone, this is your math guru. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the area of the shaded region. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button below for more easy to understand math concepts. The logo below is made up of a triangle and a semicircle with a smaller semicircle removed. We had to calculate the shaded area. The Shaded region is a compound shape. We have the triangle as shown, and then we have the semicircle strip. So therefore, the total area for the shaded region will be the area of the triangle plus the area of the semicircle strip. I'm going to start by finding the area of the triangle. To calculate the area of the triangle, the area of the triangle is equal to half of the base times the perpendicular height. If you look at the diagram given, we have the triangle with the base given as six centimeters, and then we have the perpendicular height is your 10 centimeters. So I'm going to draw a rough sketch by the side, whereby I have my base to be six centimeters, the perpendicular height 10 centimeters so putting that back into my equation that's equal to half times 6 times 10 and not forgetting to put the unit square centimeters so therefore that's equal to half of 6 as 3 3 times 10 we have the area of the triangle as 30 centimeters squared the next step is to calculate the area of the semicircle strip. If you look at the strip, we have the big semicircle and then we have a smaller semicircle cut out of the big one. So calculate the shaded region for that strip. We have the area of the big semicircle minus the area of the small semicircle. Put in the formula, area of a semicircle we have that as, because it's a semicircle, so that's going to be, from a semicircle, that's the area of a circle, that's pi for the big circle, or semicircle, pi r squared, divided by 2, and then for the small one, I have that as, pi small r squared over 2. For the big semicircle, We've been given the diameter, that's the distance from one part of the circle, passing through the middle to the other, as 10 centimeters. That's the diameter. To find the radius, radius is half of the diameter, so therefore the radius r will be the distance from the center to the side, and that's 5 centimeters, that's 10 divided by 2. So we have that as... For this question, I'm going to use pi equals 3.142. So therefore, the area of the big semicircle will be pi 3.142 times radius squared. That's 5 times 5 all divided by 2 minus area of the small semicircle pi is 3.142 times. If you look at the small semicircle, we've been given the radius, that's the distance from the center to any part of the circle, as 2 centimeters. So I'm going to slot that back in. I have times 2, times 2, because it's a semicircle, half of a circle, I'm going to divide that by 2. So therefore, I have that as 39.1. 275 minus 6.284. So therefore, the area of the strip equals 39.275 minus 6.284. That's 32.991 square centimeters. Now to find the area of the shaded region, adding that together, I'm going to add the area of 
the triangle plus the area of the strip. So that's equal to 30 square centimeters plus 32.991 square centimeters. The total area of the shaded region will be 62.991 centimeters squared or square centimeters. Thanks for watching. Bye.